Hey guys, I thought I'd come out here and take a look. I've got a little bit of a windstorm going on, and this is that little bitty cheap wind turbine generator. Okay, wind turbine generator. That's all it is. It's not very special. So you can see what it's putting out right now. Um, I have I put this meter in on the 28th of 28th of last month so that'd be 28th of April and today I think is the 14th so it it's it puts out pretty good so right now here's the big battery bank voltage and it's the same one that stays consistently hooked up over here so if you go over here and look it's this little one that runs down and Here to that meter, and and the um, the output has been pretty good. I mean, it's 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 hitting hard, you know, for what it's worth. So I mean, you know, you can you can you can pretty much see that it's working it back and forth. Well, turn down the wind but it's it produces so does it produce 400 watts it claims it produces 400 watts and no it does not so i mean it does have some some pretty good pretty good power you know what i mean that's pretty damn good don't you think yep so we got a what what do we get on that that's this is it's it's winds are winds are upwards around 25 miles per hour So I'd say this is its peak. I do believe I said in the original video, and I'll show a quick clip from that. Alrighty, now I went down and I got myself one of these things that are called a wind turbine generator. Now, these are just cheap little wind turbines. Hey man, honestly, for what you're paying for those three and $400 ones that you're getting off of eBay, this thing puts out 10, 12 amps in the same winds that those are putting out 10, 12 amps, so why in the hell spend all the money? Now this is an eBay special. Pretty simple stuff. It's not a big wind turbine. It's only about a 200 watt wind turbine. 218 watt peak, so, and voltage up to 322. Back in my system, and uh, some of you guys didn't see that I had redone my battery bank. And watch out, cat. So I'll get out here right quick and you can see, look at that big old thing sitting in here. Oh, speaking of, we're going to be putting a fuel gauge in this. This is going to have a fuel gauge in it and has a special fitting that is a Parker Hannafin fitting that will go in here to make the hose go that way because these are notorious, the hose coming straight out of causing cracks. Well, just thought I'd throw that in there. Out here, you can hear and you can see, I don't know, getting some pretty rough stuff. Listen, pretty rough stuff. All right, so wind speeds in this storm, uh, they exceeded about 25 to 26 miles per hour a little while ago. And I don't know if there that might work. And now yeah, they're coming back now. So. I kind of figured that. All right, little inversion.